In this video, I'll show you how to use the Paintex plugin from Cormelt to blur out a logo, even when people walk in front of it. I'll start by showing you how this would work if the logo wasn't occluded. I'll find the Paintex category of effects and drag Tracked Paint to the clip in the timeline. In the Inspector, I'll press this button to open up the Paintex interface. I'll move to the start of the clip and then select the Blur tool. All of the tools here share the same tracking engine, so the same technique will work with any of them. I'll set the blur level, I'll set the brush size with the square bracket keys, and then paint over the logo. On the left, I'll press this button to track forward. However, because this logo becomes occluded as someone walks in front of it, Tracking will fail, and we need to take a different approach. I'll delete this layer, close the interface, and start again a different way. In the timeline, I've placed red to-do markers at the start of occlusion, and regular markers at the end of occlusion. I'll blade the clip at each of these markers, so I can track each of these areas separately. With this technique, I can ignore any clips which start with a red marker and end in a blue one because I know I can't see the logo in that clip. I'll select this first clip, then press the Open Editor button, start at the beginning, apply the blur like I did before, and then track forward to the end of the clip. Now that it's done, I'll save changes. Back in the timeline, I want to skip over the next clip where the logo isn't visible and option click on the next one where it is. And I'll press the Open Editor button again. Because the logo isn't visible at the start or end of this clip, I'll start somewhere in the middle. I'll paint the blur. track backwards, then return to the middle and track forwards. Before saving changes once again. Now I'll repeat those same steps, skipping over the next clip, then blurring the logo in the clip after it, starting in the middle and tracking in both directions. On the last clip, the logo is clear at the end, so I can start from the end and track backwards. After saving changes, it's all complete. This blade and separate strategy can deal with occlusion with any of the tools in Paintex. Paintex is available now from Cormelt.com and there's a free trial too. Thanks for watching.